Over 35 million people across the country are coming out against crime in their neighborhoods tonight, including here on Madison's West Side. NBC 15's Sharon Yu joins us live for tonight's event at Elver Park. Sharon? John, Elver Park is home to Madison Police West Side District's National Night Out. I'm here with Luna Torres and Dr. B, and they are super excited to meet you. So this nationwide effort was created as a community outreach initiative. It varies from location, but they usually have different demonstrations and informational activities. Some locations have the mounted patrol officers as well as the canine officers, making it an exciting opportunity to meet the men and women in blue in a different setting. Earlier, we were in Verona. There are also having their national night out right now and the police chief there says the relationships created through this event bring direct results when it comes to crime prevention. We can't solve crime without uh, the community's um, input and their help and, and sometimes we totally rely upon them so we partner with the community truly as part of our community policing philosophy in that it's a necessary um, approach to solving crimes is the community partnership. Now people are slowly trickling in and don't worry if you feel like you're missing out because it's a little bit far away there. Multiple locations in different cities and for the full list of locations head on over to NBC15.com. Click on the story and you'll find the locations there. For now reporting live in Madison, Sharon Yu, NBC15 News. All right, Sharon, thanks. Speaking of other locations, the Janesville community is also gathering tonight for National Night Out at the Police Department. Let's take a live look there at that event in Rock County. Officials are showing kids and adults how the canine unit works as well as what it's like to drive under the influence. New this year, an interesting event called Taser for a Cause. That's going to raise money for local charities. Community volunteers have agreed to be shot by a stun gun, a taser, for that event.